2017, the rumor that President Muhammad Buhari was cloned is still generating issues up to this moment. This is because those behind the rumor have not kept quiet. They are bent on doing everything possible to create the impression that Buhari had allegedly died and that he was cloned with one Jubrin from Sudan. But people have begun to ask questions if it has ever happened anywhere in the world. Many people want to know the possibility of bringing a dead man back into life if truly Buhari is no more. Unfortunately, some people, even the educated ones, are falling for the story without taking any step to confirm its authenticity, reality, or possibility. However, there are reasons why the cloning claim has failed woefully in the face of any reasonable and scientific analysis. The following reasons have proven it beyond any reasonable doubt that Buari is Buari. He has not died, neither was he cloned. First, the voice. After the return of Buari to Nigeria from his medical leave in 2017, people who said Buari had died did not know what to say again. Then they hurriedly came up with this cloning idea. But what they failed to tell us is why is Buari, President Muhammadu Buari, has the same voice with their acclaimed Jubri as Sudani. We keep asking why the voice remains the same, but no response. They have not told us maybe Buari's voice vocal cord was installed into their non-existing Jubri. It is not possible. 2. Facial look. Immediately after he rose from his ailments, Buari, as expected, lost so much weight. They picked on that to tell us the Buari we see as the president was another person. These naysayers, naysayers came up with many fake analyses. They edited most of his pictures, feeding Nigerians with lies that Aisha's husband has been cloned. But when Buari fully recovered, there was no difference between the picture except for the fact that Baba is aging, which is normal. The person behind the old drama Namde Kano has said what Buari has on his face was a mask. He said he had undergone ex extensive plastic surgery. This is highly illogical. If Jubri was truly dressed with Buari's facial look-alike mask, what about his voice? Ask him. Height. Number three is the height. It remains a misery why their purported Jubri has the same height as President Muhammadu Buari. Maybe his legs were cloned too. Tell these people to desist from cheap blackmail. 4. Intonation. Most of us in Nigeria speak with intonations based on our places of origin. Buari has, has his Awusa Fulani intonation and that, that has not changed. Or can anyone convince us that the intonation was same as that of a Sudanese? Oh, maybe that one was cloned too. Some people won't stop making us laugh with their childish claims. Fee five lack of proof since they came up with this cloning idea, none of them has produced any verifiable proof that it was true. Even the Guardian UK described it as a bizarre conspiracy theory from Namde Kano. Six impossibility it is grossly impossible to clone human beings from researches. Scientists said it is not doable. In fact, what they describe as Human cloning is something similar to surrogate, motherhood, or asexual reproduction. According to Wikipedia, Wikipedia, human cloning means the creation of a genetically identical copy or clone of a woman. Of a woman. It is from conception that this can be achieved, not through plastic surgery. 7. Signature no two signatures look alike. Buari's signature has remained the same before and after his sickness. I hope they won't say that that was cloned too. Ladies and gentlemen, let's be guided in what we say, write or read. There's nothing like Buari being one Jubri from Sudan. It's a lie. It's fake and nothing can be further from the truth. Buari has not died and he will not die. He will live long. Hmm. Wow. So, guys, uh, you've heard it all from a. Uh, uh, this uh, article is coming from a, a domestic politics. Uh, that is where the article is coming from. And, you know, it's been able to explain seven facts 
about Buari, Jubri as Sudani cloning Rumon. I think uh, uh, some people said, oh, Nam the Kano did not say clone. He said, uh, last year we are going to be hearing a lot of people, what people have been saying, but they are saying they didn't say, he didn't say cloning. Or oh, what have you that they say, it meant something else that somebody was just brought uh, from Sudan. Uh, who is, who is uh, the Jubri? But let's hear what people are saying and let's hear their opinion concerning this as well. Uh, there are two things that need to be done to clarify this dynamic issue. One, let the DNA of Buari be done with the supervision of the chosen world countries except the colonial master Britain. Two, let Jubri and Sudan appear in the United Nations to be cleared of the reality of real person, not cloned Buari. If these two things are done, there will be clearance. That's what somebody is suggesting there. Another says, uh, what is it to clone? Shallow reasoning. Anybody who believes that the president Buhari, another person cloned in Asu Rock office outside the one voted for in 2015 should get its or sanity examined. Someone said, the panacea to this rumor, the writer forgot that the technology can invent mimicry, component, plastic model of Buhari, effigy, etc. to deceive order. DNA test is the panacea. Is the international community in that of the person of Buari? That's what somebody is asking. Uh, someone say mentally deranged Buari apologies. Your best in is not good enough. What's a shallow way of reasoning? Uh, someone says this Chinese is totally uh, brainless. Okay, you don't need to abuse anybody. Produce your own proof mentally person. Jubri is a fictitious name. It's not existing. Let them present Jubri from Sudan. His address, his wife in Sudan, his children in Sudan before the alleged clone. Then we present our PMB in Nigeria. You see, you don't give answer to baseless allegations. You don't react to imaginary things. Doing that, you are giving credence to his falsehood. Do, doing DNA tests meaning you believe the allegation. Why that? Never let them continue. If Jesus can be killed, Moses was pushed. Moses were pushed. Uh, by humans that denied that that faithful servant of God not to enter the promised land. Forget the blackmailers, the distractors, and lamentors, lamentators, the mummers, and faith governors. Maybe may PMB succeed. Someone say when fools are talking, the wise one in their midst shouldn't trade words with them. The propagandists are nothing but brutes of fools. The popular saying, silence is the best answer for a fool. Someone says, my own uh, is Jubri is Jubri, uh, Jubri of Sudan is going to jail. He must know nobody can try God and go free. Uh, someone says, him being alive now and seeing Nigeria going down the stream is better for him to have been dead than being alive and doing nothing while people or Nigerians are dying in their number and looters of our resources are the saints of the country today. What an irony. This man is not Buari I know. The Buari I know was compassionate and not as wicked as this present Buari. Another says that only people whose brains have been whitewashed or infested with maggots will ever believe the imbecile. It only shows devilish it only shows devilish are those behind the fictions and those who believe them. When Rochas Tokorocha had issues with APC, he promised, he promised to uh, re uh, reveal what is in Asu Rock. Recently, Adams Oshomole said uh, he will reveal what is in Asu Rock. What is that in Asu Rock? Is it a ghost? And someone said, no doubt there's something wrong in Asu, Asu Rock, no matter how it is, how it is related to this issue. Let's say you are making a point, but what about Mr. Integrity? I mean the man the man Nigerians voted for. The man who was to take Nigeria to the next level. How come Nigeria is in a state of stagnancy, psychophancy and confusion? The army is fighting a false war and Nigerians are dying like rats. The only office working actively in is a gigantic media machine headed by Lai Mohammed to defend the regime. A lot of people though pretending to be following are still asking the same question where is the messiah we voted for the truth 
can be delayed, but one day it must surely surface. Uh, someone says here that the uh, Nigeria government is gone, no more Nigeria. So, guys, uh, let us hear your opinion concerning this uh, seven facts uh, which uh, uh, we've been able to uh, tell you. Uh, seven facts about a uh, Jubris a Sudani cloning rumor uh, by uh, MC Ebisco. Yeah, it is coming from uh, MC Ebisco and the domestic policies have presented it. So, let us hear your opinion. Leave your comment below and let's have your take. Thank you.